Yeah! Welcome back to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. Okay, folks, we are at Crumble. Well, we've been to a couple Crumble locations, let's, let's just be honest there. Uh, but we have gone to a couple Crumble locations to try some test items. And I don't know why my camera keeps zooming in and out and in and out. But we need to get this video done because I fear that with how hot it is, it is, yeah, I, I, the phone's going to cut out. So, let's get to it. What is up with the phone? I'm not like, what? This is weird. Weird. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and post for the thumbnail. We got the Oreo cheesecake and we've got the cookie pops, which may never show up nationwide. Uh, crumble employees bakers have had a hard time with these so you know if they're not a great product what's the point of them going out nationwide with them so oreo cheesecake will be here at some point cake pops are on the menu right now per the spoilers but there's word that they could get dropped just because again inconvenience so um let's go ahead and bite into one of these and you know see how it is it's almost like a cake pop it doesn't really like taste like a cookie very vanilla I don't know it doesn't strike me as something amazing I give it like I think a seventh fair right it tastes good it's a nice dessert you get three of them for five bucks I'd say it's not a bad price I don't know what Starbucks charges for theirs but it's bigger than Starbucks so it's just does it stand out no not at all so um you know is what it is but let's go ahead and they don't this is the second dessert i've had this week from crumble and they didn't give me a utensil i thought they gave out for it. i know they used to so i know i've been and they've given me a fork for a cake but anyways this is oreo cheesecake it's a cheese or cookies and cream cheesecake it is a cheesecake with oreo pieces and it's got oreo base oreo crust so yeah let's uh dive into this see how hard that crust that crust feels pretty firm um yeah but it looks good it looks good it looks like plenty of cookies and cream flavors so let's try it Ooh, a little heavy on the cream cheese hmm yeah that's a. Uh, I don't know, that's a bit too heavy on cream cheese. And like, I'm not saying it's too sweet, I mean like it's too tangy. Now the survey card they gave me was survey card C. So I don't know if they've been playing around with the recipe all week. And maybe I got the, uh, I don't know what the word is, the short end of the stick. There you go. Maybe I got the short end of the stick on this, but it doesn't look like a whole lot of crust. Uh, not too much cookies and cream mixed into the cheesecake. Now the, the the raspberry cheesecake was amazing. Uh, they ended up doing, or I don't know if it was raspberry or strawberry, whatever we we had. Um, yeah, I, it's okay. I feel like I just bought a cheap cheesecake from like Walmart or something. It, I don't know. I don't know. That was that was a huge disappointment there. I give that like a five. I'm I'm not kidding. I, too much cream cheese in that. Um, yeah. I don't know what to say. I really don't. That's that's just shocking. Uh, 
am I to assume that they've been testing different recipes and this was just the worst one? They said, screw it, let's try the one that we don't think is going to do so well. I don't know. But Snacker later, he did a review and he loved it. So I don't know. I don't know. Have you tried it? What are your thoughts if you've tried either item? Do you think they deserve to make the main menu? That's all I got to say. Yeah.